Hello everyone. Today I'm going to show you how to do vacuum filtration using a Buchner funnel. To set up your Buchner funnel apparatus, first take a ring stand, then attach clamps. Make sure that you have one of the large clamps so you will be able to gently but firmly clamp your vacuum flask in place. Make sure that you have your vacuum flask clamped into place before you continue with your setup. Next, take the rubber disc and place it on top of the flask with the lip facing up. Then take your Buchner funnel and making sure you have both pieces, gently place it on top of the rubber disc. This is your filter paper. Place the filter paper inside the Buchner funnel. Then take one end of your vacuum tubing and attach to the glass arm of the vacuum flask. This may be a bit difficult, but by twisting you should be able to get it on. Then take the other end and attach it to the arm of the faucet. Again, twist it to get it on. Now your Buchner apparatus is all set up. To start, turn on the suction by turning on the faucet. But do not turn it on too high. Then, taking your wash bottle, you can wet down the filter paper. This ensures that it does not lift up when you place your solution in it. Now, you can gently pour your solution containing your solid onto the filter paper. You may have to rinse your flask out again in order to get all of the solid out. Then you simply wait until all of the liquid drains and your sample begins to look dry. You may be asked to rinse your crystals with some cold solution. Do this gently to avoid lifting the filter paper up. In order to get your crystals as dry as possible, you can gently but firmly press down on the funnel to ensure a better vacuum. Then, when you are finished, turn off the vacuum and remove the funnel from the apparatus. In order to get your sample onto a watch glass, use a rubber policeman. Gently scrape the sample from the filter paper onto your watch glass. Try to get as much sample as possible. The rubber policeman allows you to go into the corners and the sides quite effectively. Now you know how to do a proper vacuum filtration using a Buchner funnel. Good luck and have fun!